Here is 50-50 Sterling. It's a nice neighborhood, not gated, not guarded, but very nice. Nice, wide, clean streets. Here's the driveway, three-car garage. Courtyard. And that is a door to an office that I'll show you. Here's the entryway. Stairs to the right, all the way to the left, and French doors out back. So here's a formal living and dining. It's extremely clean, very well kept, really no scuffs on any walls. Here's the kitchen. Standard appliances, but nice. Throw all the uh, cafe line. Standard fridge. Maybe you could add a built-in double islands. And then an Eden nook with a little built-in. Water feature. And then a bar area. Kitchen from this angle. Pantry. It's quite large and quite tall. And then we'll go in the back. Covered patio here. There is some road noise in the back. It is soft. Not sure if it comes through video. You cannot see anything. Here's the pool. It has two water features here, one on this side, one on that side. Fire pit, and then the water feature over here. Outdoor kitchen. Not sure if you can hear. It wouldn't personally bother me, but I know some people would not like it. Um, but it's soft, and at least you don't have a visual at all. You cannot see anything through the trees. A little outdoor shower. Uh, and a little half bath for the pool area. Go back inside. Here's 
There's the garage, which is quite large. Um, but you have a closet here, a closet here, just regular standard coat closet. You have what they're using as a gift wrap room. Um, could be an office. There actually is some ducting in here, but it's part of the garage. And then all these built-ins. Three cars wide, attic space up there, central vac system. It was a good size. And over here, you have what they're using as we're staging as an office. That's the door that goes up to the courtyard. Closet, so considered a bedroom. And then a Jack and Jill bathroom that wraps around. I'll show you the other side. Here's just a half bath for guests. And then going back to the office, and then here is another bedroom. With the Jack and Jill bath. Laundry room. I believe this is an exterior door. Yeah, this uh, goes up to a little garden area. That's just someone mowing the lawn. And then the primary suite. Little kitchenette area here with fridge, storage. This room is quite large. Access to the backyard and a double sided fireplace that is next to the bathtub area. Closet is not as big as some of the others we've seen. But you do have those storage cupboards uh, when you come into the bedroom. This is the shower and the toilet, vanities. And then upstairs. So it lives like a single story. Upstairs is some bonus. Here's the loft. One bathroom up here. Another good sized room. And another with its own ensuite. And then this is staged as a little movie room. And then just access this is probably, yeah. The windows closed, you don't hear much. Um, I didn't notice it downstairs. 
It's hard, there's a lawnmower running, but you hear a little bit of street noise, but it's not bad. It wouldn't bother me. More look. That's it.